it's science, 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 it's science, 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 it's polymers, it's chemicals, it's matter and gravity, it's beakers and clamps and funnels, one inside the other, it's S C I E N C E. What is it, Miss Rebecca? It's science. It is. It most certainly is. My friends, welcome to today's science show. My name is Miss Rebecca with the Shaler North Hills Library. Hello, Miss Ng. Hi. How are you? You know what? I'm having a wacky day. It's just a wacky week, but I'm I'm so happy to be here. Can I, I just am. say that that was a wonderful introduction song to science with the the use of the instrument. Music can also be scientific. Can't it, though? I think so. I think so, too. Well, friends, welcome to the Science Lab today. Also, on behalf of our guest <gasps> scientist, Mr. Asparagus. Hi, Mr. Asparagus. Mr. Asparagus is along for the ride today. Safely. I finally get to meet you. Yeah, hi, Miss Singh. It's nice to see you. It's so good that they're getting to know. I know, I know. My I'm friends, so glad. Today's science experiment was inspired by uh, Miss Liv, and her little video will go up around this one with ours. And what we're going to do today is we're going to see if they sink or if they float. And you know how I feel about slopping in water. It's always fun to slop in water. As long as you're super special grown-ups say it's okay. Yeah. You really shouldn't slop in water without their okay. I mean, it happens from time to time, but you really probably never should. Right. You never should. You should always ask them. Okay, so let's clear our, our surfaces. We won't need a tape measure. Are you sure? I'm positive. Okay, okay. <laughs> Just remember that slopping out. Uh, yeah. We do not need our beaker. We won't need this leveler. We don't. Maybe we do need the rock. Maybe. <laughs> we don't need this. We may we don't. need this, though. Oh, yeah. This pipette, just to further our slop. Pipette. Is that a scientific name for it? Maybe. Okay. Oh. Thanks, Miss Rebecca. Okay, so what you're going to need is you're going to need a container. You're going to need some stuff. And then you'll need another container to put your wet stuff in. And then you'll need water. Because we like to do experiments here in the science lab that you really don't need a lot of stuff, you know? Right. right. So we'll move, move the scales. And then we'll carefully bring in our tub of water. Wow. Okay. Here is our tub of water, friends. Is there... Are there... Do you, is pepper in there or anything? There's Has not it been pepper treated? In there. Chlorinated water? No, I did clean the container before I filled it with water because there were many crayon bookers in it. Okay. And I just didn't know how that would really look on film. That's cool. So, yeah. You know. That's cool. So, what we're going to do is we have a container of objects. Okay. And one by one, we'll go through them. Friends, our first object is. This rubber ducky sheriff. Do you think this rubber ducky sheriff is going to... Miss Cara says it's hard to hear you, so can you talk loudly? I don't know why. Uh, it says your mic's connected. I feel I always talk loudly. But maybe just try to be louder. There's a blue button. Hmm. Well, I'll just be loud. Can you hear me now? Hello? Is that better? She didn't respond. Better? I guess she can't hear you. Uh, Cara! Oh well. And now loud and soft. What? Just kidding, just kidding. Oh. Okay, friends. So right. we're going to go on now. Our first experimental item is a sheriff rubber ducky. Do you think it will sink or do you think it will float? Can you hear me? Here we go. You have to yell. It's better because you're yelling. So just keep yelling. It's good. Okay. Well, it floated, but not straight. So, you know. I would still say that's a float, though. 
would say it's a float. It's an unsatisfactory float, I feel. Look at that. Oh, my gosh. Look at the... Oh, what? It's cool because if it's, like, Ooh. sideways like this, you can really see it. Half floating. submerged. Yeah. Now, friends, usually we never need our clamps. Oh. Jeez, these are hard to squeeze. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Nice. Okay, so what is up next? A golf ball. Sink or float? What do you think? I think sink. I think it'll float. Okay, let's see. Okay. Oh. <laughs> well, that <laughs> sure sunk, my friends. But wait, leave it in there for a little bit. See if it rises to the top. Should we move on to a next item? Yeah. Now, this is a little bit exciting because what we have here <gasps> is this porpoise. Oh. Now, yeah. now, we know that the porpoise isn't real, but it is a porpoise. Do you think the porpoise will sink or float? I guess it could be a dolphin, too. I actually don't know if those are the same things. Let's oh. see. Miss Ng, what do you think? I think that's going to float. <laughs> well, <laughs> let's see if it rises to the top. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, it's okay because it's not breathing, so it's fine that that porpoise doesn't float. Let's yeah. try another sea creature. Ooh, a starfish. Sink or float? Sink. No, float, float. I think it's going to float. Well, <laughs> that's that's not floating either. But you know, I don't know that they're supposed to. So it all works out. I mean, it's, I think it's floating like just I don't, really. I don't, it's not at lowly. all. No, a little bit. Okay, let's go for another one. It might come up though. It won't. Hmm. An eraser topper in a vibrant shade of green. Sink. Or float? I think it's going to float, and then when it fills with water, it's going to sink. Oh, what a twist. I mean, Here we go. yeah, when it absorbs all the water. Well. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's going <laughs> to rise to the top. I feel that that went down faster than the golf ball. I think it did, too. I still think that golf Look, the golf ball's coming up. Look. No, it's not. I hit it. It's moving. No, it's It's, it's rising. Okay, friends. The golf ball's rising. Here we go. Our next item. A sparkly My Little Pony. Sink. Which one is that? The green one. <laughs> okay. Okay, if it, it was the rainbow one, I would say that Do it you think would this sink. Is a tomato? That's tomato pie. Or maybe cherry pie. <laughs> tomato pie is a restaurant in North Park. Tomato pie. Sink or float? That is going to float. <laughs> for now. It's sinking for now. Nothing is coming back. Okay. I think it's... Let's move on. Ah, the ball's coming up again. It's not. I hit the thing. Oh. 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 That's definitely going to float. It's a fit. Float, 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 float. It has to float. Well, it's swimming. It's not. Okay. <laughs> Move the the bucket so that we can all see these things floating because I think what's happening is you can't really see the floating. Yeah, I think everything's not floating. <laughs> okay. okay. Here's our next one. All right. What's this a cork? It's a cork. This is going to sink. Is it Just gonna kidding. Sink or this is float? totally going to float. This is going to float. But we don't know. No, dude, it has to float. Something has to I float. I think gravity, something's going on with the gravity in the lab. <gasps> it's floating! It's floated! Okay. What if you submerge it and it fills with water? Is it porous? I That's think a porous. That's a science word. Porous. But it's still Ooh. popping up. 
But maybe maybe because it's porous, it doesn't it isn't an absorbent porous. Oh. Maybe the pores it just flows through the pores. Unabsorbent. Disabsorbent. <laughs> non absorbent. Not absorbent. Not absorbent. Okay, let's go on to our <gasps> asparagus. Friends. This is the dawning of the month of asparagus, the month of asparagus, 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 is going to float, it's going to float, 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 float. <laughs> All right. Okay. Well, but see, you can see the golf ball has come up about half an inch. It hasn't at all. Let's try a metal paper clip. Ooh. That's so light, it's going to float. It's so no, light. No, that's going to sink. But it's metal. It's going to sink. What's it going to do? Let's see. Sinker. Now. <laughs> Sorry. Jeez. I moved the important tool. <laughs> I bumped it. Okay. What about a paper clip coated in plasticky stuff? I still think it's going to sink, but then rise later, like in an hour. All right, so for now, you can see that metal one's coming up, though. It's Look at not. that. It's not. No, it is. Look, you can see it. Okay, angle. we have controversy. What about a paperclip coated in chocolate? Oh, it's Oops. Squidward. No, it's not. Wait. Flounder? Flounder! Flounder! What's Flounder going to do? Flounder is definitely going to swim <clears throat> poorly. I really thought some of these would float. I didn't think the it cork would floated. The cork. Okay, so now <laughs> we have this Lego gal. All right, Lego gal. And we have this Lego gal. Okay. So we're going to set our one Lego gal here. Okay. We're going to try a Lego gal experiment all right cool let's see what this lego gal does sink or okay. float that is gonna float <laughs> Woo! Ooh, she floated nice. turn her over that looks like something from s lawn order Ooh. svu these clamps Miss Carr wants to know if, if this show is perhaps sink or sink. <laughs> it may be. Mm. But look at that her. That she's floating. She's going, now what we're going to do. Yeah. Now everybody who's familiar with little Lego people, you take them apart and you put them back together. What parts of the little Lego person sink or float? Whoa, this is weird. The B-52's hair? So here's all of our Lego people parts. Okay. Did her head come out of here? I don't think so. I think the mini figs. No, I think it does. Oh, does it? Okay. Oh, her it. hair. Yeah, you could probably pop her hair off. Gosh, I have always loved redheads. Hmm. I mean, not for real, but I've always loved Even red Prince hair. Harry? I Especially know you love Prince, Prince Harry. Harry. Yes. I, I, I wish I had red hair. I like your hair. Thanks. Okay. okay. So we have all these pieces of this Lego body. <sighs> what should we put in first to see if it sinks or floats? Miss Cara, what body part should we put in first? Or Mrs. Adatabi. Or Mrs. Adatabi. Mrs. Adatapi, her son, she has this son named Justin, and when I worked here a long time ago, there was a writing contest, and he won. I was one of the Congratulations, judges. Congratulations, Justin, Justin. he's awesome. Anybody. You know Justin? Oh, I said Justin. Sorry. I thought, like, did I say that was his name? You did. Oh, okay. That's cool. He is so nice. Okay, well, I'm going to start and with And she has a hair. wonderful daughter, too. Okay, sorry. Oh, sorry. oh congratulations should... on your wonderful daughter. Yeah, Alicia. Alicia. Does, how old is Alicia? <laughs> Anybody have a preference for which body part maybe sinks or... Oh, Cara thinks the head. Oh, okay. Okay. Sink or float. Right. Oh! That 
looks like Law Miss and Order Cara, SVU. Take that now, out. Now it isn't. Now it isn't sink or sink. Oh. Well, we know what it is. Mm. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, gosh. we're gonna try the feet next. Okay, feet. Sink or float. Feet don't fail me now. Lego people are buoyant. They are. Okay, let's go for the hairdo. Oh, can you just imagine this ponytail on me? I like your ponytail. It's your ponytail, and I like it. Hey! <sighs> Sink or float hairdo? I think it's going to float. Oh. Whoa, it's crazy. Look at that. It's floating like that golf ball. Now what? Golf ball's coming up. Okay, so now we have... Look, the, she's still floating. Now we have the torso and the arms and the hands. And the neck. They're going to float. Sink or float. The neck always floats. Whoa! Look at that! Look, Look at, at that. that! That is something. Okay. Now you know what does not float? What? Playmobil. Because my brother and I used to play Playmobil in our pool all the time. Yeah? And the when we would tip the... Pirate ship over all the people would sink. What's a Playmobil? Playmobil is another, like, you don't put them together, but they're characters. It's like a German toy. I'll have to show you. Oh. Anybody else know what Playmobil is? Anyway. Did you ever go to Fun by the Pound in Swickley, the toy store? They have yes. a giant Playmobil person standing outside. Oh. That's Playmobil. Yeah. That is, I know who she is. I mean, I know what that is. That's a crab. Is it a crab? Yes. Okay. I, I wasn't sure at first if it was a lobster or a crab, but I do believe it's a crab. I think it's a, it's a horseshoe crab. <laughs> Is it? I don't know. I don't think so. Yeah, I don't think so. Friends, sink or float? Float. <gasps> oh! That wasn't right. Oh. Well, if the golf ball can rise, I guess something can something float in this. Should it did. You bother? just, we were doing something else and, and nobody saw it rise. And then it went back down and was tired. Just kidding. Well. Put the horse down at the bottom already and, and watch it rise. It's See. not going to I think rise. I think that's actually going to float. I really do. <laughs> Things are getting rowdy. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I think that's going to float. I really do. Gently. And hold on to it still. <laughs> okay. Come on, let's get the ball out of here. <laughs> let's give the horse room to float. Hey, the horse is floating! Do you remember the, um, David Letterman he used to have that segment called Will It Float? No. Oh, that was the best. I love David, David, David. Look, the horse is still floating. Dude, I, th I, th I thought the horse would float. Horses are good swimmers. Huh. Interesting. Not the result I expected. That's okay. That's science. That is science, but you never know until you test what you think. Mm -hmm. Or, but sometimes the data just tells you mm -hmm. what to expect. Mm -hmm. And then mm -hmm. you follow. Follow the data. Follow the data. Mm -hmm. Well, my friends, this has been Science. And this is Sink or Float. Wait, what is the science behind Sink or Float? Like, what made some things float and some things not? Well, I feel like um, if you are curious about that, then you should investigate it further. In your own scientific lab. Yeah. Oh, we can come back next week with that the answer to the question that um, this answer is for. Because I wonder what... Do you think uh, it's polymers? I don't think it has anything to do with polymers. Um, I think it has something to do with buoyancy okay. and uh, weight and hollowness. Yeah. <laughs> and sturdiness. Yeah. And, uh, and items composition. Oh, wait! Oh, let's use that. Hold on. A suck of water. Woo! That was fun. Do that again. Again. I don't think. I don't think Hold I on. got Hold the on. full. Yeah. 
This is a pipette, I believe. A pipette. And you suck a liquid up. Yep. And then you put it where it's supposed to go. And when we just suck up this water, it just goes here. It's buoyancy, it's polymers, but not today. It's composition, and it is the other thing. Weight, maybe. Density of the liquid. Density of the liquid, maybe temperature of the liquid. It's science, that's what it is. Chemicals, S, C, I, E, N, C. E. Science.